Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Marisa. It is the 1st of October, my favorite time of the year, the spookiest and scariest time of the year, and I am just loving it. So in honor of that, we are having a Halloween haul. So let's get started. Hey guys, so first of all, I just want to show you what I got from Target. I just got these two things, this really heavy wooden Frankenstein's monster. It's $5 each, but it's really, really good quality. And this adorable witch, I just love her. She's so cute. Look how thick that wood is. So it's really, really heavy. And I really love this. Great quality. So I'm going to be doing some projects with that. And first we're going to start off. I just want... I found one of the... I found another one of these. Um, and this guy from the Dollar Tree. But this is going to my friend... Gabby from Gabby's Crafty Witch Life and I am going to link her channel. I'm going to send this off to her because she just loved it. So there's her channel right there. And I'm going to send this off to her with a couple of other things. She just really loved the sign and I found another one and I found that cool little cauldron there. So I'm going to send that off to her as well. And, of course, I got one for myself so I could do it on my channel. So maybe, Gabby, you want to do a collab? We could do our little witch cauldrons together. That would be cool. Anyway, please go check our channel out. It's amazing. All right, so this is like, this is a Dollar Tree haul. So these are really heavy. These are pumpkin letters. And I found exactly what I needed for my channel, Wet Paint Contemporary. So I really love that. Um, I'm going to be doing this like art fair, art and food fair, so I'm going to actually use that on my table. And I'm possibly going to sign up for another uh, like pop-up shop, so I can use that as decoration. So that's really, really cool. So I found these candles. I think I got these last year. I love these, like the Day of the Dead themed candles, and I got two of them. So I found two, and these are really, really awesome. These are supposed to be for snow globes. These are plastic, and they have like this extra little cap here to keep liquid in for snow globes. But I have another idea. I'm trying to get it out. I'm actually going to make some crystal balls with them. So I'm going to see if I can do that. I'm going to probably do like some kind of paint pour. Uh, maybe do some like translucent paints. Um, I'm actually probably going to put some lights inside and let's see how that comes out. But that is my idea to make some crystal balls with them. Quote unquote crystal balls. So I think that would be really awesome. I love that idea. All right. So let's move those out of the way. All right. Up next, I found this very beautiful day of the day. Very sparkly. And I love that it has a little, you could pop it up. And I love that display. I love the Day of the Dead. I think it's really beautiful tradition. So that we put that guy there. And I have to say, Dollar Tree is really coming strong again. So, all right, what we got next? Oh, so I got some glossy Mod Podge this time. I think I got some matte, but this is the gloss. Um, I'm doing like some journaling and stuff. So I think that'll be great for uh, that like decoupage and stuff anyway so we got white sorry the camera unfocused um white birch candles and these smell really nice i have to say it's very very nice and i love that little like decoration with the leaf and the uh rope i think it's beautiful it's like very that rustic feeling to it and then we got some more day of the dead little signage i love these these are so beautiful. These are perfect for like the edges of shelves and stuff or tabletops. I think it's really nice. You got one. And then there's another type. So I think that's beautiful. I have a lot of the Day of the Dead. I think it's so colorful and really, really beautiful. So I'm really happy I found these two. 
All right. So what do we have next? We have some wood pieces. I've been finding some really beautiful wood pieces. So I got the beautiful, um, that like kind of red truck, you know, that very iconic truck with the pumpkins in the back. And it's a really nice size. I got some little mini acorns for ornaments. And you get eight pieces for a dollar. And you got some pumpkins. Again, eight pieces. And I think I got one more. I believe, yes, the fall leaves. So I got some beautiful fall leaves. So I've been getting really, really lucky with the fall and Halloween stuff this year. And of course, you know, if I don't use it all, I can save it for next year. But yeah, that's great. I, beautiful, these beautiful wooden pieces. And guys, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell. Okay, so part two. So we got more of these little mini glass containers with the corks. These are great to make crystal necklaces. Um, I think it's really great for like intentions or you can use them for beading and little glitters and stuff And then I got the larger size as well Every time I see them. I'm like grabbing some more. So that's definitely a repurchase. I got a nice little um, Bundle hoarding bundle there. So these are glass So it's a dollar. It's actually pretty heavy and it's a really nice texture to the to the uh, container it's great, again, for herbs. And, you know, you saw my herb garden in my last video. So it's time to dry some. And these are plastic, but I like the shape of them. I think those would be cool for, like, to make your own bath salts or teas. And I got three of those. So there's that. They didn't have a lot of glass ones, but I got what I could find. And I love you could label them. So... Up next, we got some more stuff here. So there's that, um, I forgot what's called, the foam. The florist, like the florist foam. Um, I want to use it so I could put my little eyeball black, um, the spider and eyeball flowers I got last time. And I actually can get it to stay and make a nice little display. So I got some of that foam. I love that. And I got some more spooky, creepy cloth. And it's a pretty great size. It actually covers my whole table, the one that's on there now. So that's beautiful. And these are LED lights that my friend told me to get. I'm actually going to use these inside of the crystal ball. I think it will give like a nice glow to, yeah, Hopefully this will work. Um, I'm gonna figure out like what type of paint to use when I pour over it But yeah, I'm gonna put the lights inside there So I'm gonna save it for that so let's move these guys out of the way I really like those it looks like it's gonna be a really nice soft light So I found some felt <clears throat> and I like the colors. Um, I have no idea what I'm gonna use them for right now, but I really like the colors uh, but this is a canvas board. Um, again, I'm going to do like those fairs. And I may need like an extra sign or something. And those are great. They're very sturdy. So I can like print some papers out and make another sign with it. And so I got some um, red felt. I got some beautiful purple or lavender. And I got some plain white. So I have no idea what I'm going to make with it yet. But I just, they caught my eye. And I think it's cool to have a little bit of fabric in the house. And these I thought were adorable. This is like squishy foam. You know. Um, so I thought that was cool. But the thing was, was that I thought it actually had the design inside. But it's actually on the packaging. <laughs> But I love the squish it. It's actually great for like a stress ball. So I love that. I love to play with that. I saw it. I had to get it. So, and I have yet to make my ASMR video, but I'm thinking of it using all art products. So, uh, but yeah, so I, I had to get that. I had to open it up right away. And I think that is it. 
guys, that's all I got this time. I am really enjoying finding these beautiful things. I'm just getting, I'm just collecting a whole bunch of stuff so I can make great projects for you for the Halloween season. I got a whole month's worth of stuff. I have a BB craft unboxing coming up uh, for Halloween stuff, and I cannot wait to get started making my crystal balls and figuring that out. So, yeah, guys, that is it for today. Please don't forget to check out Gabby's channel. I'm going to put in the links below. Thank you guys so much for watching, and please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.